Well, it's been four full months since I had any desserts, any cakes, pies, cookies, any type of dessert. So I started May 1st, so May, June, July, all of August. Now it is September the 1st. And um, honestly, no really major cravings at all uh, this, this month. I think the second month was the one where I actually kind of felt like, man, that looks kind of good. But again, if you don't, I don't have any of this stuff in my house. Um, and so I'm, I'm going to go to the stores. I don't even think about buying it. So I think in a lot of ways, um, at some point you kind of get, get off of that. I have been lately been drinking a lot of water, um, mainly water with pretty much every meal. Um, and uh, also, like I mentioned last month, I've been starting this uh, intermittent fasting thing. So again, I don't, I'm not really sure how much weight I've, I've lost. I don't feel like I've gained any weight. And I think I probably have lost uh, some weight as well. Uh, my clothes are a little bit looser in some aspects, so I think that's a good sign as well. And um, I think in a lot of ways, uh, it, some folks are really comfortable about you know weighing themselves. They want every ounce and things like that. And uh, you know, for you all, if you don't want to do that, don't do that. I, I think in a lot of ways, you don't you don't have to weigh yourself uh, if it gets you depressed or gets you sad. And again, you know, uh, your weight fluctuates uh, daily depending on how much water you eat, obviously how much food you eat. And what like that. What you want is, is the, the, the main mass of what you have, and that's a little hard to do. Um, if, you're, if you're happy about getting on a scale, go right ahead and get on a scale. Um, all I can say is this give it up desserts, cakes, pies, and cookies, um, and, and in other desserts. Um, just basically anything that's a dessert, I just don't, don't eat. So I eat more vegetables or uh, fruits and salads, uh, things like that. So it's not a um, it's not hard to do, honestly. It's, 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 it's a discipline, and if you set your mind, this is what you're going to do. Intermittent fasting is another part of that. There's a discipline to that. There's a certain part, period of day that you eat, certain period of day that you don't eat. Um, so I think along with those two, as long as being active, I don't really feel, I, I mentioned before, I don't feel exercising really helps you lose weight. Helps you get in better condition. Helps you get have you know better cardio. Gives you some tone when you lift you know with lift weights and things like that. Uh, but you don't lose weight by working out. Uh, you just can't work out that much to stop eating. You know, like if you eat a hamburger or you know or a pie or cake or something like that. You, you have to work out forever for that. So it's just better not to eat that. So anyways, um, so those two things I think are helping me uh, maintain my weight, lose weight, um, get in better shape. I do feel strong when I, when I work out, um, and uh, I'm, I'm happy to get rid of that uh, sugar um, addiction, basically, uh, off, off, off of my palate. And I think, uh, I think originally when I started this in May, I thought, well, I'll just do it for the summer. Uh, I'm just going to do it for the rest of the year, and um, maybe from now on, just no more desserts. And it is a, it's a little bit hard in some ways, um, because... Uh, Everywhere is desserts. Um, you know, the beginning of the school year, there's the desserts going on, uh, beginning meetings and things like that. Uh, if you have a birthday, you, you don't have a dessert, you know. So, and uh, sometimes people get upset, and, you know, if they make you a cake or whatever, and it's just birthday, they say, well, I just don't eat sweets anymore. Um, it, it's hard for people to understand that, you know, if you want to be disciplined and you want to maintain your weight or lose weight, you just got to be strong and uh, don't give up. For you out there that, that, that wants to give up sugar, wants to lose weight, um, I mentioned this before, do something. If, if, if you continue to do what you're doing, you're not going to ever lose weight. Uh, you're probably going to gain more weight. So figure out something, cut out something in your diet that you don't need or don't care about as much. Uh, start getting more active. Um, this week I actually rode my bike to work basically uh, four days out of five. Um, anyways, just uh, be active. Go out there and be active, and you don't um, don't give up. If you want to lose weight, I believe in you and believe in yourself as well. And don't worry about losing weight to, to look good. Think about you're losing weight to maintain your health. Uh, I don't think you need to run marathons to prove how good a shape you're in. That doesn't matter. Uh, what matters is your health, your individual health. And if you maintain weight, that's positive. If you lose a little bit of weight, that's positive. I really feel this. It took you a while to put on weight. If you lose it too fast, it's not natural. Your body's going to fight harder to try to get it back. And I, I've talked to some people about that, and, and I've seen that. At some point, 
you know, five, 10, 15 years into your weight loss, it just starts sneaking back up on you. You gotta be really vigilant in a lot of aspects of it. And it's tough to do that. Uh, when you get older, it's, it is a little harder to, to you know, to work out. Uh, running, running now is not as easy as it was 15, 20 years ago. So you just gotta stay vigilant at it and don't give up and be positive about it. And basically, uh, believe in yourself. Believe in yourself, and if for some reason you, you give up uh, sugar, give up the sweets and whatnot like that, and you had a weekday and you ate a cookie, you, tomorrow's a new day, you start over again. So for, my, for myself, May, June, July, and all of August, so four full months, uh, no cookies, cakes, pies, desserts at all, and um, I feel great about it. And obviously I never did drink any, I haven't drunk any uh, sodas since like, 1999, I think, or 1998, something like that. It's been a really long time, so that's not ever a problem. Um, and so basically water, I drink a, a lot of water with my meals and this water in general. So that has zero calories, so it's fantastic. Thank you for watching, and uh, if you like this type of content, please subscribe to my channel. My name is Herbert Minji. I am the Internet Legend, the most unique content anywhere in the universe on this channel, right here, and it does compute. Compute that, everybody. Yeah.